Get ready for a cool new card game that connects to a parallel universe. Special cards act as portals, bringing monsters to Earth to become buddies with humans, and through friendship and courage, help them take on fight challenges. It's called Buddy Fight. <clears throat> if I knew this was going to happen, I would have made sure Doei had Genma's deck to use. <gasps> well, it doesn't change the fact that I'm going to win this tournament. Why does Shido have Genma's deck? Got it! <laughs> Great Duke Astaroth, that's legit! <laughs> <laughs> Knew you'd like it. Besides, the next round's gonna get tougher. Yeah, if we keep winning, we can meet your little friends here in the finals. Uh, Tetsuya, who are these guys? They're my analyst and deck builder. Here to represent for Team Tetsu and Dai, yo. I analyze stuff, and I build stuff. Bro, I'm seeing double here. Are they alter egos of Demon Lord Osmodai? Mm-hmm. Spot on, yo. The real one's doing his thing. Powers unite! Dragonic Punisher! You know the plan. All you have to do is win your matches for us to succeed. And when the tournament's over, the one holding the cup on stage, adored by everyone, will be yours truly, Magoroku Shido. But if the plan's going to work, you'll have to win out there no matter the cost. Do you understand me? Or should I spell it out? Huh? Well, if I've got to win at any cost, some of it should be paid to me if you catch my drift. How dare you! I've already given you more than enough! This guy, huh? Doesn't know how to negotiate. Oh well, you can't blame me for trying. It's been real, Sheeds. Don't you see this is important? Where is your school pride? Your sense of honor? Commander I. I'm just outside Ibo Academy. Perfect. According to our radar, the unknown monster is still close by. Remember, you're undercover. We don't want anyone to recognize you. No problem there. Huh? Everyone knows glasses are a perfect disguise. I still don't see why I can't just go in and investigate as myself. <laughs> I've got a signal here from our mystery monster. What a total ripoff! Why does he have to make things so difficult? Uh, huh? Why are we waiting? Ozzy Dehaka! Our deepest apologies. It's proving difficult to find a new dark presence. Rouga's not easy to replace. Enough excuses! Master desires someone tenacious and well suited for the Dark Core deck! Maybe Jin Magatsu would be a good fit. He's arrogant and only cares about himself. He's perfect for the powers of darkness. Make it so. Let's see what the dice say. Okay, that settles it. I've decided I'm gonna lose my next fight. And what about your promise to Shido about helping him win? He was foolish enough to pay me up front. 
And he won't give me any more. I always say you gotta pay to play. You really do live up to your uh. reputation, Jin Magatsu. Tasuku, this is an undercover operation. <gasps> I understand you're taking bribes to fix a buddy fight. I never could figure out why they called you the uncrowned king, but I guess here it is, huh? Well, this is awkward. You know my name. I gotta say I'm impressed the great boy wonder cop would know who I am. We believe someone secretly entered into an illegal buddy contract with a powerful monster, just like Rouga Aragami did. Our GPS tracking system indicates that the monster is prowling somewhere around here. And you think I have something to do with it? You tell me. But for the record, I don't acknowledge someone like you as a true buddy fighter. <sighs> Purposely losing a card fight is an insult to your opponent and the game. I don't really care what others think. I just keep my head down and do what I want. If that's true, it's a pathetic attitude. You may not be behind this, but it doesn't matter. Cause wherever there's trouble, you can always be found close by. Sorry, Tasuku, but I'm picking up the monster over there. Guess not. I'll be watching you, Magatsu. Keep those streets safe. It should be right here. What kind of monster is this? Uh, what's happening? Jack, no! Something's wrong. I've lost Tsuku's signal from Ibo Academy. Commander. It's worse than that. He's vanished from the planet entirely. Uh, uh, uh. Jack! Wake up, Jack! Uh, 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 hey, pal. Uh, whoa, where are we? Armor Dragon, Galvanic Feather Dragon. I've never seen the real thing. We must be in the Dragon World. It's a battle arena. Yeah, but... Why would you bring us here? Monsters from different worlds gather here to compete. The winner is recognized as the strongest and added to the ranks of Ozzy Dahaka's Army of Darkness. Ozzy Dahaka? We don't want any part of it. Let us go right now. Jack is my buddy monster. I won't let him get caught in a battle like that. I am the gatekeeper of this arena. If you wish to leave here, you must fight me. End of move. Wow, is this really the same kid who used to be called the weakest fighter in his grade? Tetsuya Kurodake of Team Tetsu and Die! Give it up, folks! Your move. Draw. Hey, check it out. I had no idea Jin uses Katana World. For sure, bro. It's a world that tons of skilled fighters use because it's the best for making all sorts of sweet counterattacks. Only he would draw Demon Wei Kara Kurenai right away. It's an impact card that deals four damage and can only be cast when your opponent has four or less life points and two or less cards in their hand. It's time to knock those kids out of the running. I'll add it to my gauge. Eh, guess I better make it look like I'm trying. Buddy call, evil in heart, Yami Gitsune to the center. I call blood knife, Kimensai to the right. C splitting, Irokamaru to the left. Huh? Is that a g goblin? No, a Skull Warrior. A Skull Warrior is born when someone's soul is brought back to Earth as a demon. And that is my monster. I have risen for battle and will destroy you. Oh yeah, I've been dying for a fight. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? You're freaking me out, yo! Heads up! Huh? 
Sai has the ability to penetrate. Oh man, that's not good for us, you know what I'm saying? Relax, kid. Kimensai will probably vanish after this turn. Vanish? The thing about Skull Warriors is that most of them are destroyed at the end of a turn. These kinds of monsters can only be summoned to our world for one attack. <laughs> no matter how strong they are, I'm not scared of them. Whoa, take a look at that! Huh? huh? To darkness. <sighs> His turn is not done. Why'd he vaporize him, yo? I choose to send the Skull Warrior to the drop zone and then draw a new card. To darkness is Yami Gitsune's ability. You'll see that the goblins aren't destroyed for nothing. Look alive, kid. Check out that continuous attack! Now Tetsuya's down to only four life points! Hmm. If you had kept Karakur and I, you would have been done on your next move. Come on, a dog. Let's throw it down, yo. Check it. Oh yeah. I'm gonna pay three gauge to get this monster out of his cage. I call Great Duke Astaroth. He'll take you to town, hoss. You'll want to surrender with this homeboy in the center. Let's feast on some Katama slime for lunch. <laughs> That's his new card. Broski doesn't waste any time, does he? Yo! Yo! A link cast is best for destroying all the rest. Astaroth takes zero gauge to unleash my spell card rage. No charge in my hand grows large. Draw two. Ticka ticka one. What? Yeah! Increase gauge with Key of Solomon first volume. Add life with the Key of Solomon second volume. A steady assault of spells. Now I get why guys choose Magic World. Hi, buddy, call my main man, yo! Demon Lord Osmonite to the right! A buddy gift boosts his life count to six, and he sends a fierce line up to the field! Boom, chicka, wah, wah, yo! Yo, Osmonite's legit, you'll see it's true! One sec he's there, hey, what's he up to? The sneak attack, dangerous backdrop, yo! Like I said, they're not destroyed for nothing. Hey, I defeated that guy! Incoming! Cast! Demonway Gepakugiri! <clears throat> I suppose I'm only able to take out its soul. If this battle arena is only for monsters, then humans have no place here. Indeed. We have no use for such pathetic creatures. I don't know how you ended up here, human. But be gone! You heard the dragon. Tezuku, go on. But I'm not leaving you here. Why argue? He's willing to let you go free. Don't worry, you won't be alone. Another will appear just as I did. Huh? <gasps> <gasps> I am known as Jackknife Dragon. Findard the 100th. Young man of destiny, just what are your desires? Uh, I wanna help people. But I'm a kid. I gotta be an adult. Can you help? If it's what you desire, I shall help you, young one. I get it. You don't want me to get hurt. You're protecting me. Listen, Tasuku. It's your destiny. Your battle must not end here today. Time to release the Future Force! I will fight you in place of Jack. No, Tasuku, just stand down. I don't want to lose him. He's my only family. What are you doing? You're actually putting your own desires before the needs of others? You know this makes you the... The same as Jin Magatsu? Yeah, well, maybe so. But... I don't care. I choose to protect my family! End of move. Wow! After that link attack by Astaroth and Osmodai, Magatsu's down to four life points! Next turn, I'm gonna finish the score and represent with Diabolical Hardcore!
Yeah. Jin, do you really plan on losing to this guy? Let's see. I pay one gauge and call Yami Kitsune to center. No, wait, make that to the right. I call Tempest Garo O to center. Talk about a bonehead move. What's he thinking? Like Kimensai, the Garo O card disappears once its ability is used. Capiche? If he places that monster at center and it disappears, then. Then his center will be wide open for the start of Tetsuya's next turn. He's practically saying to him, Hit me with your best shot, bro. Fire away. What's this? Is the pressure getting to him? Has he totally lost it? What a dunce! What's Magatsu thinking? I pay one gauge and activate Garo O's ability. First, Yami Kitsune, attack Astaroth! Soka Kitsune. He came back again with Soul Guard, yo! I'll end it with Garo O. As you can see, Garo O's ability increases his power and gives him double attack. No! Yami Kitsune, now to darkness. So what's the deal over there, short stuff? Is your buddy trying to win or not? You were eavesdropping. I'll admit I may have overheard a thing or two. With To Darkness, a Skull Warrior that's caused damage to an opponent can be sent to the drop zone and then one card can be drawn! What's this? It looks like the sun. <sighs> hey man, I'm really looking forward to seeing you buddy fight in the big tournament! Gow! With the effect of To Darkness, you can draw one card, just so you know. I drew it. I really drew it! Kara Kurenai. Now that I've drawn it, what do I do? I can't believe it. I guess somewhere deep down I really did want to play this card. Kara Kurenai can only be played when both centers are open. You gotta think this happened for a reason. Why do you say that? I saw him up there, the Sunfighter. I have to win this match now. Because I seriously want to beat him in the final. That's the spirit I like to see. Tetsuya, we lost this one. Say what? Don't worry about it. It'll make you stronger. <laughs> you didn't think you'd be any match for me, did you, human? Not yet. That's enough. You must go. Do you remember back when we were both rookies on the Buddy Police Force, Jack? We were sent out to recover the stolen core deck case and found ourselves surrounded by that gang of criminal fighters. Have that card. The moment our powers fused together as one, that card was born. Tasuku, do you believe that a miracle can really happen again? We won't know until we try. We've been through too much to give up now. Let's put our strength together. We can't quit this without a fight. Okay. Here's to going out with a major bang. Strength! New strength! Look, we have a new impact car! Galvanic Thunder! I can't! Let's combine both our energies to become one!
I always believed humans were inferior to our kind. But who would have known there are those who can bond their powers to the power of a monster? I am defeated and my life belongs to you. Let's go home. Yeah. Final phase! And I cast. Huh? One who calls forth calamity. Oh, oh, oh. This world shall be tainted red. Demon Way, Karakura and I! Game over. Winner, Jin Magatsu. Awesome! Talk about a finishing move! What do you mean you still don't know the whereabouts of Genma? A message? From who? Silence! <gasps> Dear Seifukai, I thought you should know that Genma's Koryukian deck is hidden in the student council's office. What the? So pulling that card made you change your mind about throwing the fight? I guess. Uh -huh. I'm sorry for suspecting you earlier. It didn't really bug me much. I'm used to people accusing me of stuff. I see you won your match. Yeah. Guess the sun was in my eyes. You must never have that problem, hey, Mamakari? Hmm. Magatsu's true qualities reflect the goodness of light that works firmly against the Dark Core. There's no way. Light within darkness. Now that would be the most suitable for the Dark Core. The clock is ticking, Shido. That was a close one, but that monster is still on the loose. Tsuku! I'm so glad you're back! Are you hurt? Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Tsuku, why didn't you call in? Where did you go? What happened to you? Kind of a long story, but whatever. We got time. Hello there! I'm Paruko, here to guide you through the world of Buddy Fight! So how about that Tasuku Ryuenji, hey guys? And that Jackknife Dragon? They made a new impact card. I guess that's how they formed Gargantua Punisher, too. Wish I had skills like that. Now I totally understand why both of them are working for the Buddy Police. I tell you one thing, I wouldn't want to be a criminal fighter facing those two. Can you open a Buddy Rare card? What do you think? it when Noboru Kodo takes on Magoroku Shido. There is a strange connection between these two during last year's ABC Cup. On the next episode, it's Noble Heart, together with the Dragon Knight. Join us for a buddy fight! <laughs>